Copenhagen was a fun event. There is no doubt about it, but I missed some top 10. So let's get into it because good Lord, the Luminosity to put up a hell of a run. Yes, they came up short. I don't want to hear it. OG helped us out with this one though. Noli getting the credit assist as Magic Bear will put it away. Listen, we'll take all the help we can get. OG, a valiant effort in the one and two round. The Luminosity proved to be a little too strong. The boys in blue are looking good. And that's your number 10. Here comes number nine. It was Rettle setting things up off the back wall and Magic Bear double tap is what Corelli likes to say, Magic. And he's absolutely right. Limitless found their limits against this LG squad. Magic Bear was fantastic this weekend. Granted, we almost got into top eight. Would have been really cool if we did. But look at Magic Bear off the backboard. Two touches. There goes Snowy. And now a new season at number eight. It's a downfield pass. The setup rattles the connection. Hold on. This one's not done. This was such a good series, man. Crowley and I were sitting there just losing our minds with this touch from Rettles. We were putting them away in a canister and putting them back on the shelf. They're expired. It's too late. Don't know what any of that means means and it's not really a good call but guess what we're going to keep things rolling now into number seven because vitality put up a hell of a fight but og really didn't we were just a little bit better that touch is absolutely absurd from the captain slater with the tater look how he gets hyped in the face camps that's what we wanted more from lg we want to see slater get absolutely lethal on the field and that's what we get here the extra touch the one two give and go and into number six we go the pass into the box off the crossbar bar down ski for rettles vitality met their match if we won game seven i swear to god and I would have been the most obnoxious, insufferable people on the timeline for all of the fans to enjoy because this one was an absolute barn burner at Bar Down Ski from Reynolds. Here comes number five, Luminosity, Limitless again. This series just had so many great shots from the LG boys finding a way to sneak through the captain on these last few clips, really stepping up. Cheese, crossbar, at least got an extra touch from two defenders. Magic Bear, the fake, and Rettles, the finish. This is about the full team effort, and this gets us to number four. It's a pass in the middle of the box. Cheese, one, two, give and go special. Got to close the distance, something that we have harped on Genji about closing the distance between the pass. Cheese with a massive 50. Magic Bear, the right back into Cheese, and good lord, Complexity never saw it coming, though they did get the series win. I don't really care. Rettles from the back well, here we go. Our top three, the captain to Magic Bear, the give and go special. You're seeing a, a harmony, a theme with these clips. And I know what it is. It's the give and go special. The team's getting fully involved. That extra touchdown field, Magic Bear into rotation, catches the pass and sends it on its way. Now into top two. This one was a dangerous one as Magic Bear tried to get it right over to Cheese. Carlos, the slot Sorella right underneath for the big dunk. That big man, Carlos. Somebody put the sun in his eyes. When we were watching Cheese through the qualifiers, when he had the sun in his eyes, literally staring in the eclipse he was unstoppable now we didn't open up a window in copenhagen but we certainly opened up some absolute barriers because cheese was unstoppable but he wasn't our number one you know who was it was magic bear of course it was magic bear look at that double tap man he is so good yeah let him know rattles let him know this was a good series from the sidewall magic bear the cross field read the reset the setup the dunk my man he's so good he's so excellent that's your top 10 and that's luminosity baby we are too good